I don't have to always use my advisor or my noticer. I can discover for myself what Jesse is like. I can use my third DNA skill, discoverer. The discoverer is a doer. You are being a discoverer when you are doing stuff and finding out for yourself what is good and what is bad. So with Jesse, I decided to discover for myself if Jesse was a nice person. I tried introducing myself to Jesse and started talking to her. Will she be my enemy? Will she be my friend? I don't know, but I'm willing to try and to discover what happens next. When I am in Noticer, I get to see all the paths I can take. Do I do what my advisor says and take that road, or do I discover for myself? Talking to Jesse was discovering for myself. Now, I'm not saying the discoverer is better than the advisor or the noticer. It all depends on the situation. Let's listen to some other things an advisor might say. Those are times when you should probably listen to your advisor, right? You don't want to try to discover for yourself what it's like to dive into shallow water. You could hurt yourself. So that is your brief introduction to the DNA skills. Build them up, and they can help you live your dreams. And that brings us back to where we started this video. We come back to the question, what is important to you? Just take a few slow, deep breaths and think about one thing that is important to you. You see, we don't use our DNA skills for just anything. We use them for the things we find important, things we value. Does advisor help us feed our values? Then we go into advisor space. Or maybe advisor is not so useful. Then we may want to try noticing. Or maybe we want to go into discoverer. Then we flexibly shift into discoverer space. You can think of values as the activities that you like to do and that are important in your life. Values can help you know more about the kind of person you are, and they can help you direct your discoverer, noticer, and advisor skills. This diagram shows six activities that are the keys to having a happy and satisfying life. Click to see what other teens have said about each one. Then, think about ways you express that value in your own life. With practice, you can learn to use your discoverer, noticer, and advisor to help you flexibly deal with challenges and to live the life you care about. This is Inner Strength. That concludes our introduction to Inner Strength. Let's review what we've learned. Congratulations, you're done. To find out more, follow this link to go to the DNAV website.